everyone, welcome back to Better Biomed. Today, I wanna to talk to you guys about something that I noticed in another video. I can't quite explain it, and I would like to get some help from you, the community, over what's going on, all right? So first off, I wanna tell you that it's about the Hospira Plum A and the Plum 360 pumps. So I found a video where this guy is using a calibrator and he also has some metal discs that are for zero PSI and 10 PSI, but the calibrator, it looks like a Hospira pump that obviously has a different set of software installed. And the front face plate has got connections for cables. So you have a data cable and a power cable and they come out and they connect to your pump module and you can calibrate the pump module. I've never seen one of these devices ever before. So I'm reaching out to you guys because I'm really curious. Have you guys heard of this? Do you know who has access to them? I've never seen them for sale. I don't even know what to search for when I look for one of these. I would think it's a Hospira calibrator, but it looks like it's a Hospira calibration kit. So guys, I'm, I'm just curious. You're the community. Have you ever heard of this thing before? I'm, I'll put some sample images up so you can see what I'm talking about. But uh, another thing I want to talk to you guys about is apparently the Hospira Plum 360 modules to get those refurbished or calibrated. It's a flat rate fee of like $335, I think. But if I remember right, the Plum A modules appear to be only about $100 to get those calibrated and shipped out and refurbished. So here's, here's the issue. The internal components of the Plum 360 and the Plum A appear to be almost completely identical. Uh, the motors have a different revision number on them, but other than that, it's the same exact part number. And I look to see if there's any discernible differences. It looks like it's the exact same. So the only difference is the bezel on the front of the Hospira 360 is purplish, and the bezel that's on the Plum A is white. Other than that, I can't discern uh, a difference between the two pumps. So here's the thing. The bezel face plates appear to be interchangeable. So I'm just curious if there's no discernible difference and the motor drivers and everything are about the same, same power capability, then what is stopping people from taking the Plum A pumps, getting them refurbished, and then, you know, changing out the, the bezel on a bad 360? In other words, you're getting a, now a 360 module done for about $100. What's stopping anybody from doing that? Uh, because they appear to be the same. I mean, there's obviously some, some differences, like the PCBs and the 360 appear to be bluish, and the old Plum A's, they appear to be green. But other than that, all I can say is that they appear to function the exact same. And I have hooked one up uh, to a Plum 360 in a Plum A module technically ran. It ran just fine. So I'm just curious, have you guys any more information about this? Have you even heard of this? Because it might be news to you, but it appears that the parts are interchangeable and it might even be that, you know, they had to switch manufacturers and spec it out to a different manufacturer and that's why there's a different revision it looks like it's the exact same motor. I'm just saying. So guys, maybe take a look next time you take apart a Plum A and a Plum 360. Take a look at the internals. They appear to be the identical part. And the other thing I wanna put out there is if you guys have any information on the Hospira calibrator, I haven't heard of it. The only thing that I have is this video from seven years ago to which I'll leave in the description below so you can check it out. I've never seen this thing before, but it would certainly help the industry if it was available. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and uh, I'll be looking for the comments down below. Let me know what you know. <laughs>